Hi guys, Crystal here. Today I am going to do a simple brush washing. So this is my Travolger T3 brush that needs some cleaning. And I'm going to use brush soap from PAA. Um, I really like this soap because it does not have harsh chemicals in it that would harm your brush. So we all know um, shave brushes, um, whether it's um, synthetic or uh, real hair are um, an investment and we want to protect our investment. So this soap is filled with things that will help our brush rather than harm it and extend the life of it. So in this box, I already took them out, came a bag with the soap and a comb, which I was like, well, they got a comb in there. I don't need to comb my hair. I already did, you know. So first of all, this soap is like Really cool. Reminds me of like a Lego. <laughs> but um, I'm going to get my brush wet. And um, so first chemicals are not helpful to our brush. It's always important to wash your brush with a specified brush soap. Um, all right, I got my brush wet. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a figure eight on the little nubs till I get enough in there that it's wet and moist so that we can wash our brush today. I also like about it, it has a mild fragrance, but not like too overpowering to um, interact with your yummy smelling soap. All right, so usually when it looks like that and my brush looks like this, I'll do a little bit more. I wanna get it all up in there. All right, so that's when comes the comb. You can then comb your brush, which I thought was really cool. I was like, well, that's neat. So when you get suds, you just put it, you put it right back in there. Continue combing your brush. I don't wanna like comb your hair like you're combing knots out of your child's hair, roughly. Like to be nice to the brush and the comb. So, I enjoy using um, brush soap because I know what's in it. I know it's not going to harm me as a person um, shaving with my whatever shaving soap I use, as well as other products I use. Like I use pre-shave oil on both my armpits and my legs. Of course, that's gonna get in here as well. We're gonna take care of that and clean this out. And then whatever shave soap I use. So your brush can hold bacteria and odors. And if not cleaned and treated properly, it is not going to serve you a very long time. All right, I pretty much got that cleaned in there and everything. I'm gonna rinse it. And it's really important after you are done um, washing your brush with a brush soap. And right now what I'm doing with my hands, I'm just rubbing it um, in a circle to get all the uh, soap out. Now, if your brush is really gunked up, you can leave this on for a minute after you brush the soap through the brush soap. Um, and then come back and rinse it out. I'm not talking like a day. I'm talking like mm -hmm. 20, 30 minutes. Um, so I do this until it's clean. Fabulous. All right. So I'm going to shake the water out of that. There's a lot of water. Um, and then if you have a shaved towel, just rub it back and forth lightly. Not so much that, you know, you're pushing it down into, yeah, that's not, you know, helpful for your brushes either. Now, I hope you have a stand. Or you can set your brush in a bowl upside down um, to dry. Because that would help the adhesive stay from the nut to the handle. And that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed watching my shave brush cleaning video. I'm Crystal reminding you to love yourself and our planet.